Yuma Sector covers parts of California, uh, the Imperial Sand Dunes out to the west and then down to San Luis, uh, Arizona and San Luis, Mexico. Where areas like Yuma and Tucson where we've been getting overrun, you know, we're starting to regain our control of the area and it, the, the problem with it is that with that you get a lot of more violence with it. came to America in 1996. Mm, my, uh, my life in Mexico, it's uh, very poor. I have to cross the water by the desert. We have no water, we have no food, we have nothing. I live in Orange County with my wife and my uh, four-year-old son. It took me uh, two days. I was uh, 15 years old. You don't, you don't know what to do, so all you want to do is just hide from Im immigration, from the Border Patrol. The government tries to play it off, saying that, yeah, we're very welcomed in our community. So, no, everybody hates us. <laughs> you know, we're the Border Patrol, we're the Migra, and nobody cares. You know, I'm just trying to do my job. I, all I do is go to work, do my job, and come home. You know, I didn't get into this job because I'm a gung-ho secret squirrel and you know freaking navy seal type and no i got this job because it's a it's a solid career move when i when i came to america my my dad's like my best friend and then he was always talking to me and then he was like if there's nothing to do you have to find something clean something or just let the manager see you that you're working and then your interest in in work I help my my parents all the time when I came. Every time I talk to them, like I told them, I'm gonna help you. I want a better life for my brothers. And then my family needs the money, my dad, my mom, my brother. They're going to school and if I stop working, they're, they're not going to school because my dad, he was not making enough money. I'd like to get to, you know, off the border eventually. You know, I, I don't like raising my daughter on a border like this. You know, we have no family here. We have nobody here. It's, it's just us. You know, it's tough, you know. There's been agents that have been abducted and, you know, they went out down south and, you know, and they get kidnapped and they get killed and bad things happen. They happen all the time, so you can't really stress about it too much. You know, do I like to have to worry about that all the time no but you know I also chose this profession so you know and I you know I can deal with whatever comes with it